Hey, thanks for watching. I'm Michael Chankis with Charles Ruttenberg Realty here in Lakewood Ranch, Florida, and today we're going to talk about mortgages. M mort mor 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 Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in to our channel. Today's video is going to take a different spin on things and we're going to talk about mortgages and specifically the interest rates, how they play into affordability, the trends over the years of interest rates, and everything else there is to do with it. Okay, so I picked an arbitrary date in 1978 to use as an example. It was the day that Grease came out, which is one of our favorite movies. So in 1978, in June, the interest rates were... 9.71%. And for those of you who were around then, house shopping, you probably remember that. In 1982, they went up to something like 18%. So the point I'm making here is our rates today are crazy low, like crazy low. So Danny and Sandy, back in June 1978, probably had to sell grease lightly in order to afford a house. Here's an example. $400,000 house at 9.7% was a $3,422 payment per month. $3,422. Let that sink in. Now, when I pop in today's interest rates, or about 3.5%, that same $400,000 loan is $1,796 a month. A couple of days ago, an article was released by the National Association of Realtors that talks about this low interest rate economy that we have right now. And what he's saying is these sub 4% rates that we're basically used to over the last few years, they won't last, it's not normal. But it's something that needs to be taken advantage of. The time to buy basically is now. You're not only buying a house, you're buying the low rate. So if you are in the market right now considering purchasing, a few things that we suggest for you, regardless of whether you're here in Southwest Florida or if you're in another state, is first get a mortgage calculator for your phone. We use this mortgage calculator called Mortgage Something, Mortgage Calculator Plus. It's the orange icon. You can't miss it. It has a bunch of great features that let you plug in things like taxes, HOA, um, whether you're gonna pay PMI, it lets you slide and adjust how much you put down so that it'll tell you whether or not your payment's going up or down and how much. Uh, it's a great tool and it's uh, free, so go get it. Now let's take it to the next level. You're ready to buy, you're ready to start house shopping, you have a concept of where you want to be and you need to understand truly the affordability scale. There is a website that one of the lenders that we have often used, we use several, but this is just one of the lenders, and I wanna put a little disclaimer there. I have no affiliation with this. I am not promoting it for any purposes other than the fact that this is a free resource for the public to use, and I like it, so I'm showing you what it's all about. Um, it's The website is gocheckrates.com. It's a uh, Canopy Mortgage sponsored, um, Basically, mortgage calculator, you can check rates, apply online, etc. Leo Namiot is the loan officer that put this together. It's a great tool. So as you'll see here, the main page brings you to uh, a little bit blurb about Leo. And then if you click check rates, it will initialize the get your quote now portion. And there you can put in your purchase price, roughly how much you're going to put down based on a percentage, and it'll give you a loan amount. The wave escrow portion, uh, generally you want to check no, because what that means is you're putting an escrow payment together for your taxes to get paid. And then you pick primary residence, single family, or whatever it may be. I'm using a credit score of 700 as an example for this. And then I'm picking Florida and Manatee County, because that's the county that most of Lakewood Ranch is in. Advanced options, if you wanted to get a longer rate lock, you can choose that. The longer the rate lock, the more the cost. 30 days is pretty typical. So once you have that chosen, you double check your information and you click on get rates. Here we go. So now it does its thing, get da 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 da, and it pumps out today's rates. 
and you'll see the loan program, conventional, 30, 25, blah, 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 and you can choose amongst all of these different rates. So we just clicked on the 30 year rate, and here's all your options. Uh, right now, rates are hovering around three and a half percent, so this shows the detail if you were to go with the three and a half percent option. It shows you your monthly payment, your closing costs, um, and this is just a fantastic tool. It, basically what it does is it gives you a very, very accurate concept of what this home at that price and at that loan amount with the down payment and the interest rate percentage, what this home will cost you. So again, that's gocheckrates.com. Gocheckrates.com. It's a fantastic tool. The Mortgage Calculator Plus app that you can find in the App Store or on the Android Store um, is a great free resource as well. You're gonna want these things at your disposal as you start to do your searching and get really serious. You want to have a pre-approval letter, of course, that's a given. That shows that your buying power and your intent when you make your offer is absolutely sincere and you are three or four steps forward in the process so that whatever offer you submit, that seller knows this buyer is absolutely serious.